This video, this video, I'm going to show you what to write on top of your book. Alright, here's my paper, and I'm going to write on the front cover, um, my rhythm book. So, I want you to write on yours as I spell it. We're going to put my is M-Y. Let's see. My, my, my is a very large. And then we're going to put rhythm. R-H-Y-T-H-M. My rhythm. And then we're going to say book. B-O-O-K. Book. My rhythm book. Alright, now I want you to open up your rhythm book. And on this side, on the left, we're going to write, um, actually we're going to draw a little D and we're going to color it in. Looks like this. And we're going to say quarter note and it's spelled Q-U-A-R-T-E-R-N-O-T-E. -E -E. Quarter note. And I'm going to say ta because it says ta and it gets one beat. Okay. Now this page over here, we're going to draw. It looks like a pair of headphones. These are our eighth notes. And you spell it E I G H T H. N O T E, and they get a half a sound each. And so, when you have 50 cents plus 50 cents, you get one dollar, don't you? They each get um, add up to be one. All right, now we're going to write a little D. And we're going to call it a half note H A L F. N O T E half note and this is the second graders longest note it takes up two beats and we call it ta -a, or I also call it to u to help us remember that it gets two the duration is two. Ooh, I use that word duration. Mmm, we'll talk about that next lesson. All right, so today we have made our rhythm book. You have your quarter note, and it says ta, and it gets one beat. Eighth notes look like a pair of headphones. They each get a half a beat, and um, they're called eighth notes. I didn't say what they say, did I? Eighth notes say T T. Eighth notes say T T. And then at the end are half notes. Our half note looks like a little D and it gets two beats and it says ta a or two oo.